It's a very important truth that runs all through the scriptures. All through the scriptures. Your blessing in life is linked to your act of obedience, not to your act of worship. You understand what I'm saying? Your blessings in life, your blessings in life is linked to your obedience. Because obedience has the highest priority, not your worship. Your blessings in life is linked to your willingness to do whatever God tells you to do. Not all the, all the, you know, the rituals or the offerings or your commitment in just giving your reverence to God. Do you understand what takes the highest priority when God wants to bless you? God chooses to bless you. He says, I want to bless you. But your blessings are linked to obedience to God not to your worship. So, this is a truth that runs all through the Bible. It's a theme that runs from Genesis all the way to Revelation. Why did in the beginning, the first man to offer sacrifice, the first man to offer offerings to God was Cain. The first man that God rejected. Why did he reject? He was looking at the heart. So, what God is saying is that your blessings are, depends on your act of obedience and not in your act of worship. We have learned to worship God, no doubt about it. We have all learned to worship God. We like to worship God. We come to church to give reverence to God, you know. And we have evolved in worshiping God. And some of, some of us, when we came first time, you know, and we were not even comfortable in lifting our hands. We are not comfortable in, in uh, you know, vocally expre expressing ourselves, you know. But we have, we have come to realize, you know, what is real worship, how we need to worship God. You know, we, don't, we are not ashamed to even kneel down. We are, we, are, we, are, we are able to worship God through our praises, by offering our, you know, offerings and tithes and all that is great. All that is great. Your reverence to God is great, but what God is saying is that if you want me to bless you, your blessings are directly linked to your obedience. So obedience is better than worship. I don't, I don't want all these fattened calves. I don't want your singing. I don't want your songs. I don't want your music. I don't want your tights. I don't want all that you're trying to appease me. Sometimes, you know, people make a business with God. You know, want God to do something. Let me try to, you know, do something more. You know, I give more for God. I give for this ministry. I give for that ministry. You know, somebody says, if you give here, I will bless you. Try to do everything that is possible you can do, hoping that God... No. There is no favoritism with God. Neither can you bribe Him with your gifts. The blessings are all connected to your heart of obedience. Obedience to God. What is obedience to God? I found a man, David. A man after my own heart. He will do everything I tell him to do. Can you do everything that God tells you to do? 